we call it the Swiss Army knife to trailers. Not only does it have 10 sinks on it, it's got two sets of washer and dryers on it. It's got external toilets, so you wouldn't want to have dirty people go into the inner part of the trailer to use the toilets. The heart of a trailer is basically a decontamination trailer. So we found that there was a need for people working at healthcare centers or retirement homes, needed a place when they get done working or, or temporary field hospital, they could take their clothes off from the decon side, go through a shower, have a, a changing area, you, and then there's an internal toilet, and then come back outside and go home. So when they leave the job site, their their clothes are off, they've showered, they've cleaned up. We designed this discharge to be pumped, so if it was set up at a building or a warehouse or field hospital, the discharge could be attached to a pump, and then that waste could be pumped to a sewer so that you don't have to struggle with getting it emptied all the time. You could just pump it straight to a sewer. A lot of trailers like this have propane or diesel heaters, but you can't stick a propane heater system inside of the warehouse. It's not safe. So we built it with electric water heaters so it could be used inside. It says dirty, so this is the side that you would enter. Negative air return, it's got a HEP filter on it. So at the end of the day, a staff member ready to go home would enter the dirty side. This is a negative air return and it has a medical HEP filter in it. So it's now part of a decontamination. There's a chute here where they would take off their scrubs or their gear and they would discharge their uh, gear. There is a washer and dryer, which is part of the multi-use thing. I mean, there's a sink where they could clean up. You transition to this section, and then there's four individual showers. We put a uh, medical pass-through, so technically staff could put clean clothes or clean towels in here. They could access it through the outside and close it. If you're dirty, the problem was you can't come in with a clean side and grab something because now you contaminated that but you can't take something dirty, so we put this in the midpoint. Then they transition into the clean side. The trailer has, has external sinks, external toilets, but it also has internal shower sinks, toilets, and laundry with the advantage of the uh, decontamination process of a trailer. So when the healthcare worker now leaves this trailer, they exit through the clean side and they're ready to go home. So now they can go home, say they get in their car, they go to the grocery store or go wherever they need to go and they're not worried that they've got something on their clothes, their hair, their body or whatever. We're gonna splice all this together so it looks good. <laughs> yeah.